change that I've introduced in the icons that I paint, the icons that I'm calling Franciscan icons as opposed to Orthodox icons, is that in my images, the animals that I paint, the plants, the landscapes, are not caricatures of reality. They are painted with as much care as the human being who is the object of the icon. And, and so there's this icon of Saint Martin of Depores, a, uh, a black saint in the Roman Church in Peru, who was known to be able to, who brought a sense of peace wherever he went. So the dogs and cats and even cats and mice lived peacefully with one another without fighting. It's just perhaps a symbol of the peace he brought in this colonial period where Indians and, and African slaves and Spaniards were all mixed together with some sense of hostility between them. And when I depict an animal like the cat in St. Martin's arms or the mice at his feet, I depict it, as I said, with as much care as I depict St. Martin. And as a Franciscan, I disagree with the old monastic the old monastic attitude, which has become more and more emphasized in some areas, that the world is this evil place that we flee from, that the world is to be despised. I would much rather stand with the ancient Jewish scriptures that talk about the God's creation as good, as all of creation praising God. Stand with Francis of Assisi and so many mystics in both the Eastern and the Western churches who talk about the goodness of creation and how all of creation praises God. That the animals, and this again is right in line with St. Paul and his writings in the New Testament, where he talks about all of creation in the letter to the Romans, all of creation groaning and waiting for the transfiguration, the transformation that is to happen in the human race because all of creation too is called into that transfiguration. And so depicting this cat or the bear with Saint Seraphim or whatever other animal it may be that I put with a saint, I am saying theologically this animal too is called to the great, the, the, the vocation of, 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 of being drawn into the likeness of God. And, and that's uh, very obviously different from what you're going to find in a traditional orthodox image. Mm -hmm.